Time slowly drips away, just like our life. But what is life? Is it only what we see on the outside, or is there more to it? On the outside, everything may look fine, but what's going on on the inside? Someone you know gets up, goes about their daily activities. Everything seems normal until you take a closer look. People are stuck in the motions, going through endless routines. But on the inside, you find someone who is scared to admit that they are empty, hiding the rotten feeling within. It is a dreadful place to be in. Anyone would only want to get out. At every attempt to escape this nasty feeling, the doors just shut. Fear cripples in, with no way out. A feeling of loneliness creeps in. Inexpressed emotions, complete chaos. But no matter how many times this person will try, nothing. no breakthrough, found in the very same place over and over again. Does this sound familiar? It could be someone you know, struggling with drugs or alcohol. What if it's a family member or a leader, a friend at work, that guy you pass by before the service who struggles with addiction and is pressured? or someone you greet that feels rejected and ready to commit suicide. A young girl who attends church that feels abandoned and hopeless, slowly dying at heart. Oftentimes we miss it. People around us face defeat after defeat, masking their problems under the surface as if it never happened. Daily torture, feeling sick and tired and exhausted screaming on the inside, a loud cry for life and attention, yet no one hears. Or, is it you? There is a way out. We have to face it. No one can do it alone. There's only one who can truly set us free. We can no longer sit back. We need to get up and take a stand. Come together as one people. Unite in prayer to tear down strongholds that surround us. Receive freedom for ourselves and deliver it to others. Let's raise up our voices to God.